maybe maintaining the intensity at times when, uh, when you're really having te technological barriers, when things aren't working and not giving up. Um, that's always a challenge and it helps. That's one thing where, where a partnership helps a lot because if I get depressed and say, oh, you know, we've been working at this for two years and we're not getting anywhere, we're never going to get anywhere, and then Joe will say, come on, don't give up, we can do it. And sometimes it happens the other way, although most of the time it's me who gets depressed. <laughs> but, but, um, so, uh, but maintaining the, the, um, the conviction that you can do something even when it's very hard that's always uh, always a challenge. And there are certain projects that we had um, that were particularly, for example, purifying the LDL receptor. We had tried many approaches in the 1970s um, that just failed. You know, we, we really had, didn't have the technology. And then, as Joe said, it was the, there were two things actually, the monoclonal antibodies and somebody invented a new detergent that allowed us to solubilize the receptor. And uh, so um, there have been lots of challenges like that. And the, the, tr the difficult part is to maintain, to, to, to have the conviction that we just must solve this problem, otherwise we can't go further.